I'm Aaron Gould, and today we're gonna milk, milk some stuff. We're gonna milk some stuff. <laughs> Welcome to another episode of Mega Stuff with Aaron. I'm Aaron Gould, and today we're gonna make some stuff. Here's the deal. All of my lawn tools are currently homeless, but today we're gonna fix that. Shut up, birds. I need to build an enclosure for all of my lawn tools. They're outside, they get all rusty, it's nasty, it's gross, and I don't like it because it looks ugly. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some measurements and see how big of an enclosure I need, and then we're gonna make a scale model of it, and it's gonna be awesome. So I'm basically just gonna come and see what my tallest tools are, which I think is about 100 inches, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, about 100 inches. And then if I wanna put the wheelbarrow and the mower next to each other, I'll need like, call it five feet for easy access. And then as far as how deep I want it, if I want those on a wall and these in front of them, I'm probably looking at about eight feet. So we're looking at building a five by eight, real simple shelter lean to just to keep these bad boys out of the rain. Now, here's the deal. The mosquitoes are killing me. So we're going to go inside and talk about this product. Okay. Is that okay with everyone? We're moving inside. We're moving location. This is a high budget shoot. All right. Uh, mosquitoes everywhere. So we're going to go inside before I get West Nile virus. Uh. So now that we're back inside and not getting eaten by the sun and the humidity and the mosquitoes, hat's still a little greasy, that's okay. We're gonna do an unboxing of this really cool product, invention, thing that I got. Um, it's called Maker Pipe. And what it is is these like fittings that basically turns your regular like metal conduit into an erector set. So these contain miniature versions of these. So, if you can hear that, I just dumped these out. So these are miniature versions of these. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, these are coffee straws. So they just fit over the end like that. You've got yourself a structure. So what I'm gonna do now is try to remember the measurements I made before All right, so we're gonna start from the top view, if you remember. I had a lawnmower. I had a wheelbarrow from that was standing upright. Then I had a weed whacker. I had some rakes. Shovels. And what my overall dimension was, was about six feet by about eight feet, right? And that's gonna be enough to contain pretty much all my tools. So this is what we're gonna do from top view. So from side view, I'm thinking it'll have an angled roof. We'll have the lawnmower here. Is that what a lawnmower looks like? We have the wheelbarrow over here. And then on this wall, we'll have a little rack. We can put rakes. We can put anything we want. So this is gonna be our basic outline. So the next step in the process is to use these little babies and make ourselves a scale model of what we're gonna build. each end. Yes, I think that's correct. Our first two pieces, these are going to be the long sides. Whoa, I was so close to the scale. And two. Now, I don't have to be exact because more of what we're trying to do here is figure out how many attachments and what type of attachment we'll need for our structure right there. So that's going to be our ground. And let me do some quick math. Play the math music. Okay. 
Okay, so the front of our building, you can cut the math music. So the front of our building is gonna be nine feet high. Boop! And then, let's stick these bad boys up in the front. Now let's see, okay. I mean, we got ourselves a building, look at that. Now we just need to build the roof. Okay, what do we do now? Now, oh, okay. So what we might do, mm-hmm, yup, yup, check it out. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take these little guys, we're gonna put them on the top corners, and then we're gonna install some longer boys. Look at that. It's starting to look like a building, huh? All right. Look at that. We got a freaking building going on. Look at that. Got a building. Huh? Five feet. Trim that. Boop. Don't worry, we'll fix it. And we'll put one last piece through back here. So the only, thing, the only thing we're gonna add is a cross member right here. Boom, baby. Now here's a question. What if they, you can make doors out of maker pipe? You probably could. You'd probably do that. Let's try it. We got a door. Boom. Door. Look at that. Huh? What do you think? The door will close in real life. I like this. What do you think? That's a shed, if you ask me. So I think, got the door open. Hi, how are you? Put the tools in there. I think we're good to go. I think we're, I think we're golden. Look at that, I'm so excited. Make your pipe, what's up? Let's go. I don't know what else to say. I'm smitten. I'm smitten, smitten, smitten. Like a mitten. Smitten in the mitten. So, I think that's all we got for tonight. We'll catch up tomorrow when we're ready to freaking build some maker stuff. That's a gall dang shed. <laughs>